All right, Shalom, Shalom. I want to first off start off by giving our glory and honor to Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahusha, Ba'ashem, Wachakadash. Double honor to the apostles and elders that do well and that oversee this tabernacle of David that is being risen up in these last days. All right, Shalom to the hopeful elect. All right, that do not delay. Shalom to the angels that are wits in this day. Okay. All right, and this is Brother Shamak. Okay, and this message is for the blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans, the Hebrew Israelites. Okay, that are awakened to the truth of the scriptures. All right. All right. I just want to go into uh, prayer. Basically, basically going into prayer is truly faith. You know, prayer is showing, is exemplifying your faith. It's expressing your faith. You know, and this 2019 being the year of Karagma, we're going to need more prayer. We're going to need more faith. We're going to need more fear, you know, and we're going to need more diligence, you know. Need more, need more all together, man, to increase, you know, to, to guard up our loin, to be prepared in that day, you know. Hey, we do we do the necessary things, man, okay, for your salvation, man. Prove your own work. Do what you got to do, you know. No excuses, okay. No emotions, you know. All right. But I just want to go into uh, basically prayer being faith, man, okay. Especially, especially going into... Uh, Basically, examples of the prayers, you know, you could, uh, examples of prayers, you could pray in, um, sitting down like David did in, uh, first, first Chronicles 17 and 16. Okay. Uh, you could pray standing up, you know, as the Levites commanded, uh, with, in Nehemiah chapter nine, verse five, I think you could pray, uh, walking, uh, as mentioned in second Kings chapter four, you know, you could bow down as Moses did in Exodus chapter 34, verse eight. You know, you can lift up your hands, um, as is mentioned in First Timothy chapter two, verse eight. You know, you can kneel. You know, you yeah, bow down as we as we mentioned. You know, bow down as uh, Solomon did in First Kings chapter eight. You know, you got. We also face Jerusalem, okay, in First Kings chapter eight, verse uh, you know, forty four. When we pray, you know, in pray, you no know, prayers that our season is mentioned in First uh, Thessalonians, okay. But yeah, going to the etymology of praying, you know, prayer from the 13th century, it says to ask earnestly to beg, you know. Hey. Hey man, we ask earnestly and beg in this thing of ours, man. We truly, we truly ask earnestly and beg. Yahweh, why Yahweh shot, man. The true name. Okay? The true name. Alright. We request, we ask for whatever, whatever um at the time. Whatever it is, okay? Okay, let me uh we start getting some scriptures, you know. Yeah, we start getting the scriptures on it, okay. I want to start off because what what sparked the spirit to do this lesson was um you know just me meditating on praying, you know more more Hebrew prayers, you know. I brought off um palayim, you know Hebrew prayers. I brought off palayim, you know. Okay, you know Hebrew prayer then um. I go into where to find some. Okay. This is James chapter 5, verse 15. Okay. This is a scripture that really, you know, sparked it, you know. It's beautiful, you know. This is James chapter 5, verse 15. And the prayer of faith shall save the sick, and the Lord shall raise him up. And if he committed sins, they shall be forgiven him. See, prayer of faith. We got to truly believe in this thing, you know. When we pray, we got to believe, you know. Sincerely, man, sincerely, you know. Because when we, and we, I'm going to get this scripture, because also when we pray, Yahweh, why Yahweh Shah already know what we need before we even ask for it, you know. And when we pray also, man, we do, we do it uh, in private, you know. Okay. We're going to need more prayers, man, in these, in these upcoming times, man. You know, especially with fighting demons, fighting situations, chastisement. Okay. Hey, prayer. Okay. Be humble. Remain humble. All right. It's Matthew chapter 6, verse 6. But thou, when thou prayest, enter into thy closet. And when thou hast shut the door, pray to the Father which is in secret. And thy Father which seeth in secret shall reward thee openly. Hey. Hey, that's beautiful, you know. Praying in secret, man. Shut thy door. Okay. This thing about it's between you and the Most High, man. You know, work out your own salvation. All right. And let me skip to verse eight, because like I was saying, he know what you need before you even ask him. OK, it says, be not ye therefore like unto them, for your father knoweth what things ye had need of before ye ask him. 
hey, he already know what you need. He already know the increase you need and what you need, you know? All right? Just be humble and, and, um, and ask, man. And ask the Father, all right? And also when praying, um, we're going to rock, you know, uh, oh, so I'm tripping, yeah, so rock, prepare what you, uh, what you want to pray about, you know, or, and use not many words, I like, yeah, this is right here, second, no, this is so rock chapter 7, verse 14, use not many words in a multitude of elders, and make not much babbling when thou prayest, see, not much babbling when thou prayest, all right? You know what I'm saying? Not talking too much. It's going on our speech when you praying, man. Hey, short and quick. You know? But not necessarily you ain't gotta be short, but hey, know what you know what you um you targeting, you know? Alright? Know what you want. Okay. Let me get uh Sirach, the other scripture is Sirach. Sirach chapter 33. Sirach chapter 33, verse 4. Yeah, preparing what you're saying, okay? This is important too, okay? Whatever the topic it may be. It said, prepare what to say, and, and so thou shalt be heard, and bind up instruction, and then make answer, okay? Prepare what to say, and so thou shalt be heard, and bind up instruction, and then make answer. See, preparing what we say, you know? We, we you, know, you know what you want to order when you go to a restaurant. The same shall be with your prayers, man. Seriously, you know? This is just to show that sincerity, you know, to the most high in the, in the sun, man. Okay. Let me get uh John, I think, praying in the name. You gonna hey, cause in the time, man, we're gonna need that name, man. Okay? Cause the, all the laws and statutes commandments, we ain't gonna be able to uh all we're gonna have in that time is the faith, okay, in the in the name. Okay? Faith in the name, man. Okay, and anybody telling you that the name don't matter, stay avoid them, man. Mark them and avoid them. Okay, truly, man, that's a damn demons, man. Okay, this is John chapter sixteen, verse twenty three. And in that day, ye shall ask me nothing. Verily, verily, I say unto you, whatsoever ye shall ask in the Father in my name, He will give it to you, man. The name matters, Yahweh. Okay, in the Son's name, Yahweh Shah. Okay, Yahweh means He exists. Yahweh Shah means He He's uh the Savior. He saves, he delivers, okay? That name matters, man, all right? It's not something to play around with, okay? The name is important, bro, okay? Important to any other name on this earth, man. All right, let me go to uh 14. Yeah, yeah, well, basically going more into the name. This is uh, John chapter 14, verse 13. And whatsoever ye ask in my name, that will I do, that the Father may be glorifying the Son. If ye ask anything in my name, I will do it. If ye love me, keep my commandments. Hey, this commandment, man, to pray in the name. Okay, and we have the name, Yahweh Bashmi Shah. Okay? Most high in the name of the Son, man. All right? Prayer is that faith, man. Truly believe in this thing, man. Truly growing this thing, increasing this thing. Okay? And it's all through the mercy, the chosad, chosad, from Yahweh Bashmi Shah. you know, the mercy and grace, you know, that he may be merciful unto the hopefully elect, okay, and he will, you know, he's not slack concerning his promise, all right, uh, let me see what else I wanted to get, um, let me get Matthew, oh yeah, yeah, let me get Matthew, Matthew chapter 21. Because when we praying too, man, we got to believe. You got to believe what you're praying for, man. Okay? you But you praying itself is showing that you, you know, that's that faith of request. You know, that faith, that faith of begging, you know. A faith, that faith of earnestly asking. You know, all due respect and humility. And that's when, and I, as I said, man, you can pray sitting as David did. Pray standing as the Levites. Pray walking. Bow down. You know, and all these nations will be will bow in that day, okay? In that day of judgment, man. Y'all gonna y'all gonna get this action from Yahweh by Shmuel Shai. You gonna see who who is dealing with, okay? And that's with Israel too. You gonna see who Yahweh by Shmuel Shai is dealing with in that day, man, okay? With congregation, with with men, you know, with men of the Lord, okay? You gonna see? He's gonna make his actions be known. He's gonna he's gonna make his actions be made manifest. All right, but this is Matthew chapter twenty one verse twenty two. 
in all things, whatsoever ye, ye shall ask in prayer, believing, ye shall receive. Hey, that's beautiful. Hey, and that's and that's comforting for the spirit, man. When I first read this too, okay, and we probably looked it over. And we, you know, we all read the book of Matthew, okay. But this is heavy right here, man. And we shall ask in prayer, believing, ye shall receive. Hey, man, we gonna we gotta believe that we are gonna be comforted in that day. That we gonna we gonna we want that we one of those servants that's gonna eat while everybody else thirsts and hunger, you know. And that we gonna be a joy, and that we are gonna rejoice while everybody else is shame, you know, and doing that Jacob's trouble. During that time of the RFID chip, during this time of the year, Karagma, when it's gonna be big, when it's gonna be pushed more, you know, and the, the agenda is gonna be pushed more. All right, hey, we gonna need this prayer of faith. All right, I brought off Palayim, man. Hebrew prayers, okay. All right, make make your call and election sure. All right, and I just wanna go. Uh, it's a uh, GMS quick and powerful. The elder Taza one, man. Hey, these are good prayers to go go uh take heed to, you know. That lift your spirit up, that comfort your spirit, you know. They increase your faith, you know. Hey, these are good lessons, man. You know, I took heed to to a few, a couple myself, you know. It will it will continue, okay. So yeah, so shout out to the to the uh, elder of the GMS Atlanta camp, man. Uh, the Atlanta church. Uh, a Tazawan, man. Elder Tazawan, okay, Bishop. All right. All right. And, um, man. And with that, I think that's all I wanted to get on the prayer, man. You know, pray without season. You know, sincerely. You know, keep pushing, enduring, peace, love, and safety, man. To the hopeful elect, okay. And this is Brother Shamak, and I want to first, I want to end off by giving. All glory and honor to Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shah by Hashem, or Kadash. Double honor to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone, man. All right, Shalom to the hopefully lit. Peace, love, and safety to the hopefully lit. And a few aqua, aqua few, okay, that are also taking heed to this truth, man. All right, Shalom. Keep the faith, Keep the faith.